Hi there, just started to do a recording a little while ago, but the battery went flat on me. And for a while now, I've been thinking that I wasn't getting the full travel on my X axis. So um, I decided to investigate. So I've had an investigate. I've got an extra inch now on the travel. I thought something was not quite right, but um, where the... I don't know what you call it. Um, hmm. The block which affixes the x-axis to the top of the main base. What was happening is, as the x-axis was travelling over it, is it a gib or, or is this block in here a gib? I can't remember. Well, what was happening is it was travelling across. On the end of this casting, there was a lip in the casting and it was catching on that. So I took this off. Um, filed away the lip and that's it, it's running fine now, it's travelling all the way to the end like it should do. So it's, it's gained it's gained an extra inch on the travel, so that's good. So that's one thing out of the way. I'm now going to put it back together. Uh, the reason this came about is um, one of the grub screws had worked its way loose on the Lovejoy connector on the X axis. Um, when I've been um, working on the machine tonight, setting up the proper coordinates and everything, so it, it jarred it loose. So I thought I might as well do that at the same time. So, hence the the dot punch at the moment with the with the spring removed. It was so I could ex experiment for tool heights and things. But uh, I'm getting there, and I should shortly be uh, cutting from files and not just training the machine. Okay, bye for now.